it's wednesday april 5th and we got our hands on a roadmap update this is something that they release every two weeks in regards to the roadmap on what we're going to expect to see for the remainder of the year in terms of patches and updates with this they released a few more uh features that we should expect with the 3.19 build the first one is tractor beam attach and detach now they actually spoke extensively in the last inside star citizen episode last week if you haven't seen it just go and check it out but what it says here it says this iteration of the tractor beam gameplay will add functionality to the tractor beam attachment of the multi-tool allowing it to detach and attach items from ship's item port this functionality can either be used for component exchange replacement or restock which is rockets or scavenge other ships before we move forward i just like to let you guys know that we're doing a giveaway for this month of april of the great cat stv and all you got to do is subscribe to this channel and leave a comment on any video within this month of april all right so let's move on new player experience an initiative for improving the initial first 30 minutes of gameplay experience which will help players understand the context of the world and introduce them to some of star citizens basic features this update focuses on the experience in area 18 and Bishini point up next is new missions which is the salvage contract with more civilian access to salvage ships, contract brokers are offering salvage jobs for derelicts around Lagrange Point around Stanton. These brokers charge a fee for their service, so this will require some buy-in, but the contractors are free to keep any salvage material for resale. Up next is the Ghost Hollow PvP mission. Adding a new mission type to the Ghost Hollow point of interest in Stanton system, making use of the Comrade as well as the AI Nav Mesh. This mission type will create PvP encounters where players will need to fight for control over terminals for a chance at big credit payouts. Up next is the Lorville Cityscape, reworking the Lorville skyline to better fit the scale of the city and its distinctive buildings. In other news, the April 2023 subscriber promotion in-game flare will be the Hosanna ship paint for the Centurion subs. Imperator subs get the Hosanna and Aspire ship paint packs and subscriber exclusive store offers the Central Tower ship paint pack as well. All this will be available in the Alpha 3.19 live patch. Also, the subscriber ship of the month is the Misk. Razor. They also mentioned the possibility of a new build for 3.18.2 in the EPTU branch for tomorrow and uh, no news on the 3.18.1 patch. You guys already know what to do. Leave a like, subscribe. I'll see you on the next video.